Hey YouTube, welcome to another video from Skinny Medic. This is another quick tip video where I just hold my cell phone up and I give you a quick tip because you never know when you'll be the first responder. One of the things that can hold up even a seasoned first responder is triaging through multiple patients. Now this is where you have multiple critical injured patients and you are, have limited resources. So you have to be able to triage these patients. In EMS, we put them in different colors. We start out with green tags, which is walking wounded. Uh, red tags means, oh my gosh, they're getting ready to die. Yellow tag is they're critical, but they not, may not necessarily die yet. And then the black tag is they're dead. So two of these categories hold up first responders. And I want to give you this quick tip because the black tags will hold us up. They're dead. You have multiple patients that are critically injured. They may be bleeding to death. They may be you know, about to die. And we want to try to save everyone. So we, we walk up these black tags and we try to save them. We start chest compressions. We do all this stuff when the person next to them may be bleeding out. And you get tied up on that. So we got to leave these guys. We get, if they're dead and you have multiple patients, you have limited resources, you have to walk away from them. Um, there may be someone else that's bleeding to death that could use your assistance. The other person that's going to tie you up is the green tag. These are going to be your walking wounded. They're able to walk around on scene. I'm not saying they're not critical, but they're able to walk around. They will tie you up. They're going to be screaming at you. They're going to be crying and doing whatever else. Save my baby, save my parents, save whoever. They're going to be screaming at you and they're green tags, they're fine. So you have to be able to leave them alone as well because they're gonna be the last ones to come off scene if they're walking around green tags. So the ones you need to focus on, of course, is your red tag and then, of course, your yellow tags will be next. But you have to be able to triage these patients because you don't wanna get tied up on someone who's dead or someone who's walking around screaming bloody murder when you have someone who's got uncontrolled hemorrhage and you could put a tourniquet on, put pressure bandage, things like that. So this is my quick tip. It's a little long for a quick tip, but you never know when you'll be the first responder. So you have to build, be prepared for that. Um, for those of you guys who are subscribers to my channel, sorry for the no gear review this week. Uh, we've been tied up shipping out orders. And honestly, I almost forgot to do a quick tip this week. So uh, this is a quick tip. Uh, so sorry for no other video this week, but we've been busy. We've been shipping out orders to you guys. So thank you guys for the support. You guys have been awesome supporting my family with this uh, business. So if you haven't checked out my website, go to shop.skinnymedic.com. We have first aid kits, we've got first aid supplies, trauma supplies, medical supplies, whatever you're looking for, it's there. So thank you guys for the support. You guys are awesome. You never know when you'll be the first responder. Remember, you need the right gear and the right training.